So how does the brand new 57-bit linear addressing mechanism work? Well, let's dig into it. So this is why I can't stop calling it last instead of linear address 57. If CPU ID for EAX of 7 and ECX of 0 returns ECX bit 16 of 1, that means your processor supports 57-bit linear addresses. You can feel free to update your CPU ID lab in order to see whether you support it or not, but mine definitely doesn't support it. When you support this, and if the operating system supported it, then you could use five-level paging instead of four-level paging, which is just another level. So how does that work? Well, you had 48 bits before, and now you have 57 bits, right? So 0 to 47 is 48 bits. 0 to 56 is 57 bits. So they just tacked on another 9 bits on the end in order to say we will use that to index into a page map level 5 to find a page map level 5 entry. So CR3, max phys adder, minus 12 to find the page map level 5. 9-bit index, oops, and then from there, same thing, you know, max phys editor minus 12 to make your way to the page map level 4, etc., etc. I can feel the, you know, Intel manual people just screaming as they run out of room, and they're like, ah, we don't have enough space. That's why they also don't have this as max fit as that or minus 12. But, uh, but yeah, so it's, it's not conceptually difficult at all. It's just the notion of you add more bits and your processor MMU is updated to understand it and watch it, walk it. Uh, and other than that, it's exactly everything's the same as we learned in the very beginning to level paging. Now, the one little point I would make here is that when you turn on page size extensions, at least for now, uh, it doesn't support anything larger than one gigabyte pages. So they could definitely have done, again, the same you know, game of accumulating up some number of bits and having a super, super giant thing for 512 gigabyte pages, but they didn't. Now, just as optional material, I will point out that I eventually found this table, which basically is exactly the same as the table that I just made myself. And so I was super pissed when I eventually found this after having done all the work to make that table myself. But here you go, this table, it's in the manual somewhere. You can check it out and it's got a bunch of nice notes for you. Finally, uh, there's this diagram, just another finite state machine, which is, you know, beautiful. You know, I don't know what you see there, but, but I think it's just great. It's a hypercube. I think it's a hypercube. Anyways, so it, uh, it starts out with no paging. And so the question is, you know, how do you get to these various paging states? And, you know, this would be completely incomprehensible had we not uh, covered some of this material, but it's actually not too bad here. So start out with no paging. CR4 is 0, so this is your reset state if you reset the processor. CR4 is 0, CR4 page is 0, so paging is 0. Physical address extensions is 0, long mode enable is 0. If you just set paging by itself, boom, you're into 32-bit paging, and it's all good. That's the simple two-level paging. That's what everybody used for a long time. From there, if you set physical address extensions, now you've got this option for 32 bits to originally 36 bits and now, you know, 52 bits. Uh, so backing up a second, if you want to get to four level paging, there's multiple routes here. So you can first set the long mode enable in the register and then you can set physical address extensions and then you can set paging and then you'll be in four level paging or instead you can fit set physical address extensions, then set long mode enable, then set paging and you'll be in four level paging. So two routes same direction to get into four level paging. And I believe this wasn't on here. I'm pretty sure I added this in. So this diagram is from the manual and here's my little extra addition here. So if you want to get to five level paging, you would start from this intermediate state. You would set last and you would still be in a no paging state. And finally, as a last thing, you would set paging equal to one and now you would be in five level paging. 